12.30 in the afternoon down on this Sunday afternoon, November the 3rd, 2013 on a Sunday afternoon. Time now for the Waterman Jesher PJ Williams. The afternoon report. Sunday, November 3rd, 2013. Good evening. Good afternoon, everybody. Our current conditions at 12.30 p.m. in North Massachusetts, 43 degrees at the temperature with overcast skies. With the humidity of 80%, wind speed north for about 10 miles per hour. 3.10 inches, 2.37 degrees, and a visibility of 10 miles. And a hip. Wind chill about 37 degrees. Okay, let's take a look at our little radar scope. It shows a couple of batches of rain showers around Smithfield and Green. Film Rhode Island, and a couple of batches of rain showers in North Attleboro and Alderbury, stretching in Norton and down to Mansfield and on to Foxborough, stretching on to Franklin. Another batch of rain showers in Hanson and stretching on to Citrus, and a couple of batches of rain showers. Around Plymouth and Rareham in Massachusetts, here. Adam Batches of Rain Charles off the province sound and then off the coast of Maine, here. This is awkward. I'm awkward. You're gorgeous. Wait, what? And a line of snow and rain and sleet shots off the Nova Scotia coast and then Batch of Rain Charles off the Nova Scotia coast, stretch and the Prince Edward Island in Canada, here. Never bet the rain showers in Easter Prince Edward Island, Canada. I don't have a skull. Little bet of rain showers around New York City. Bet the rain showers off the Jersey and Delaware coastline. There. And a batch of the rain in western Texas. And a line of rain showers in New Mexico and northwest of New Mexico. Batch of the sleet and snow showers in southern Colorado. And a line of rain showers in the western Washington, Oregon. And a of rain showers off western Washington, Oregon. And snow and sleet spells in western Washington, down western Oregon. And batches of snow showers in eastern Washington, Oregon, down to Idaho, down to Montana, down to central Wyoming, and switch down in eastern. British Columbia down to Alberta and Saskatchewan and back to Rain Charles in Eastern Saskatchewan stretching in Western Manitoba. Here. And down in Northern Ontario down for Northeastern Minnesota, back to Rain Charles in UP and Michigan. Victoria, Kansas. Good afternoon. 59 degrees. Here. Okay, let us take a look at the satellite loop and it shows the batches of clouds it's covering Mexico. Is the, this is Sonia, stretching from Mexico, the clouds stretch Mexico down from Western Texas and down in the Plain States and in the Dakotas and in Minnesota, down to Manitoba and Ontario, down in eastern Washington and Colorado, and stretching down to New Saskatchewan, down to Alberta, down to Montana. Is sponsored by Southwest Airlines. Find our fares online only at southwest.com. Okay, Tropical Storm Sonia. Take a look at the topics. Tropical Storm Sonia. Movement. Nine miles by five degrees. Wednesday, 45. Gets to the 60. Miles per pressure, 1,003 millibars. And it's going to make landfall. Monday at 7 o'clock. Yeah, let's do durable. Let's do different. But mostly, let's do. Okay, a triple threat of storms in the eastern Pacific. Here. Typhoon close to movement, 8 miles per hour, 205 degrees, wind speed 75, I'm guessing 90 miles per hour. Travel depression, 30 movement, 90 miles per hour, 285 degrees, wind speed 35, I'm guessing 45, it's going to make landfall in southern Vietnam, and travel depression, 31, movement, 19 miles per hour, 270 degrees, wind speed 35, I'm guessing 45. It's going to make landfall as a category 4 typhoon in the Philippines. Okay, let us take a look at our map situation, a high pressure located in the northeastern California. And at a pull of high pressure. From the Ontario stretch to the Great Central Great Lakes and down in the Western Tennessee. And a stationary front for Nevada, stretching Utah, Wyoming, and a warm front in South Dakota and Iowa. From the boundaries in eastern Colorado. New Mexico. And two batches of coal front, one from Pennsylvania stretching to New England and then down into Nova Scotia. And another one from Cuba stretched all the way down to the Prince Edward Island, Canada. Alright, seven day forecast goes like this. By right this afternoon, a slight chance of showers before 2 p.m. Most of the skies are 946 degrees. No point about 11 30 miles per hour. Chance of space is 20%. For tonight, most of the skies are gradually becoming clear skies. Lower than 22 degrees. No point about 16 miles per hour. Monday. Saint Cloud Island, 45 degrees, north wind about 7 to 9 miles per hour. Monday night, Park Cloud Island, lower 20 degrees, north face wind about 5 miles per hour, becoming a common evening. Tuesday, Park Cloud Island, 52 degrees, calm wind becoming southeast wind, 5 miles per hour in the afternoon. Tuesday night, most of the Cloud Island, lower 32 degrees. Wednesday, Park Cloud Island, 60 degrees. Wednesday night, most of the Cloud Island, lower 46 degrees. Thursday, a chance of showers, most of the Cloud Island, lower 65 degrees, chance of precipitation 40%. 
Birds and that. Shout out to like free muscle cast guys. The low on 41 degrees. Transfer space to 60%. Friday, muscle size guys are near 53 degrees. Friday night, muscle size guys are 20 degrees. And Saturday, muscle size guys are near 50 degrees. Peters, what a phrase of the day! A showery day on top, and much cooler conditions will come in the next two days. This is PJ Wins. Hope you have a good afternoon and good day with a good positive attitude. Here. Yeah?